Now, Paul McDermott has been at the forefront of the comedy industry since the Doug Anthony All-Stars first took to the stage in the 1980s. Since then, Paul has hosted a successful radio show, several TV programs, and he performed stand-up around the globe. He's a pretty talented oh, guy. Sorry. Pretty talented. He's about to take the road for his new show, creatively titled... Paul sings. He's here now. Good morning, Paul. Good morning. How are you both? Good, mate. Very, you look very, very well this morning. You look very elegant. Most of you look elegant. You look very sweet. I've made an effort. You hey. turn it on for this time of the morning. Don't don't let anyone say Mutual you don't. Mutual Let me read this now. I want to read this from your press release. It says, Paul sings, prepare for a swoonful. Paul McDermott. A swoonful. A swoonful. What is that? I must, I must admit, I've never read the press release, but a swoonful, <laughs> I suspect, is, is swooning over the beauty and wonder of the songs. So I what suspect. sort of music are you doing on this tour? They're songs that we did for shows like The Side Show and for Good News Week and Good News Weekend and Good News Week Night Light and other programs that, um, that we wrote for the TV, got performed once and never got performed again. So it's like a best of, really? It's like a, a best of songs that you've never heard, yeah. Wow. Oh, that's amazing. So you wrote um, your own songs, yes? Yes. And I believe you do have a very fine voice. Now, it's beautiful. I think your voice, I've been it's talking, extraordinary. It's hide beautiful. the meaning behind some of your songs. Sorry? Can, does your voice hide the meaning behind some of your songs? The songs Shut Up and Kiss Me and Your Jeans Are Too Tight. Oh, well, see, so what inspires classics. you for They're that? Classic songs. See, yeah, see, some of those songs are the comedy songs. We're not really doing the comedy songs in this show. We're doing, oh, aren't you? Just doing sweet, sort of beautiful songs. The strange Songs stuff. like The Darkness. The darkness. <laughs> darkness. What is that song very, about? It's very beautiful. It's about the light. Oh. It's called the darkness. I see what you did. Contrast. Right. It was, it was, yeah. Well, do, do you think of yourself more as a comedian who sings or a singer who just happens to be funny? I'm, I'm not quite sure how. I, th I don't think of myself very often. It gets a bit... Gets a bit uh, I think of you more often than probably you think of yourself. I think of you quite often. Yeah. Are you, boy? Yeah. I think that's how we go. <laughs> it's crazy time. I often go, that's Paul. I wonder yeah. what he's doing now. Let me ask you, you've, had, you've got a son as well. Xavier has just started school. Well, he's, yeah, he's five. He started school. He started school. How he loved school. I hated school. I, hated I don't know how school. you feel about school, but I hated school. He loves school. Oh, I love School's school. School's different now. Yeah, kids like school. They take care now. of each other, and it's really beautiful. I used so. to be really sort of like, you know, just sitting in my classroom listening to Doug Anthony All Stars on my daily <laughs> walk. <laughs> That's yeah. what Stop I was singing, David. That would be yeah. you. Stop singing. Yeah. 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 But, then, but let's talk about the, the, uh, the, the boys. I mean, apparently you, you got back together recently, did you? Because, I mean, it was such a, it's such a great group. And for a lot of us, you know, growing up listening to that was very formative for yeah. our teenage rebellion years, musically speaking. So, uh, did you get back together recently? Is that what I'm hearing? With the All Stars? Yeah. Um, well,. Yes, I mean we caught up. Tim Tim recently got uh, married, which was fantastic, very beautiful. So we all we caught up socially, but we haven't sort of uh, got together to, to sing. Tim appeared a couple of times on uh, Good News Week, um, and certainly catch up with Richard occasionally. Uh, He's got his own radio stuff going. Richard, very, doing but very have well. Have you ever thought, like you know, like you know, this week I've got tickets to the Beach Boys. I'm very excited. Yeah, I know so you're I thought excited. That maybe like How a many bit of, of them are alive. The fact there's only two. And I think they're really are. No, but uh, but I thought that maybe you guys could have a bit of a Beach Boys reunion sort of thing and sort of go back. I mean, you'd sell out. Do you think so? Uh, big, big tour mate, of the country? Big tour. Oh, you're hearing it first here, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> morning. Let's start with your small The All-Stars <laughs> back together. We'll, we'll get this one out of the way and then we'll get the All-Stars back yeah, together. Yeah, totally. Look, yeah. Paul, being a comedian, what what actually makes you laugh? Like, what tickles your fancy? Oh, uh, well, the, the, the bizarreness of the everyday. Yeah. Having Trucks a kid certainly constantly does. turning. Having a kid Children are fantastic, yeah, yeah, aren't yeah, they, yeah. for comedy? It never, it never stops. They're just always, uh, always giving you something. You know. Now tell me about this tour. We're not doing capital city. You're not doing capital cities yet, are you? Oh, we're doing we're doing Perth. I would okay. regard that as a capital city. Perth. <laughs> Certainly for mining. Does anyone remember Perth? Yeah, Perth. We love Perth. We love Perth. gorgeous Perth. We're I doing that this Friday. The, yeah, it's all up on uh, the website. Two shows as part of the comedy festival that's happening over there, uh, and then we're travelling to Brisbane. I think as part of the Writers Festival, and then to uh, Newcastle and Canberra. So it's uh, the capital cities. They we, are. Need Canberra, capital city, we need Sydney and Melbourne on there too. Sydney when is that going to happen? Oh well, once we get the show together, it's nice and hot. Fused by this, uh, this little Will you come back country. and sing for us a little later on in the show? Oh, I'd love to do we'll that. I'll give sing you just all a you. warm up. Thank, Thank you. you. Oh, wow. Well, just see that? Just see that? Me. I'm going to stand right there. You've oh, got a dedication now. That's Paul McDermott kicks off his national tour next month in Brisbane, and all the dates are on our website. Here's Paul now, accompanied with Stu Harley and David Sines, and the song is Nothing. Suns collapse, planets die, clouds will gather to darken skies, but you and I, we have nothing. Salt has pepper, 
black has white, intrigue has boredom as day has night. But you and I, we have nothing. What was hidden will be revealed. What was found must be concealed. But you and I, we have nothing. We're almost innocent, guilty of nothing, guilty of nothing. Hidden will be revealed. What was found must be concealed. But you and I, we have nothing. We're almost innocent, guilty of nothing, guilty of nothing. Of nothing. Except love and mornings. <laughs> <laughs>